When was Christmas? Oh. We are not done. We are not done. Ah, good. You're finally awake. Yes, it's been 16 hours and I've finally woken up. Welcome back to a, um, a surprise episode of Offering Productions because I didn't know what was going on. But I stayed through the credits and I am here at the Endless Christmas on Read Only Memories. Shall we go? Shall we continue? Point. Yes. Oh, look, I got a little. Oh, look, it's look, it's a little Turing, it's a little Lexi, it's a Jess, and it's a Tomcat. I like this tree. I want this tree. Wait, where's my Ramona? Well, deja vu aside, I'm glad you're up. I have something important to tell you. Yes, I am not your father. I know. Merry Christmas! It, it, it is Christmas, actually, in the game. Yeah. Bow, humble something, something, something. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, little buddy. I hope you don't think it too forward of me, but I wanted to give you a gift in the spirit of the season. Is it this computer that is actually working? It's one of my older paintings, but Hayden seemed rather fond of it. Perhaps you can keep it to remember him by. It's a lady. I managed to grab it from the apartment while you were sleeping. Dude, do you just... What, if I'm asleep, are you just like breaking into people's houses and taking things that are... Okay, let's be fair. It is yours. So, just don't make it a habit. I know these past few days since our initial meeting have been stressful, so I wanted to make sure you got your healthy, normal human rest cycles completed efficiently. Oh, uh, don't worry. I know you haven't had time, so I don't expect anything in return. But yes, I thought it would be nice for you to have it. Thank you, Turing. I really appreciate this, you know... The, the hair reminds me of Sombra from Overwatch, actually. Excellent. I'll try to find a place for it on the wall. Uh, not my wall. My walls are bad. My walls are shit. Well, I suppose you still have plenty of work to do, hmm? Writing and whatnot. I hope you've enjoyed having your computer working again. Lappy doesn't seem to hold anything against me. I've been spending most of the morning trying to form a plan for the newly awakened ROMs, but I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed. Yes, I would imagine. Perhaps I'll go out for a walk. May I join, tiny little robot? Of course. It is Christmas Day, after all. I think we can forgive ourselves for a little procrastination. We can also check in on the group at Golden Gate Park, at least. Oh, right, the riot. Let's go. The city away. Zone 3. Zone 3 was that map that we actually hit. Okay, so first we save. Why do we save? Because we always save. Every every chance we get, we always save. Uh, that you know what? I can't even spell my name anymore. And I want to go to one place. I need to go all the way over here. Flower Mansion. Talk to Jess. Go to Young Gate Park. Uh, zone three. Alright, let's go to Market, Market Street, because that's where everybody is, apparently. Hey, look, you know why I'm here. You know why I'm in Market Street. It's Dana. Cactus. Night Witch. Nanya. Well, or, for, or Formula. Ramona. Hey, you two. Staying out of trouble where you can and kicking ass where you can't, I hope. You have no idea. I had 
had to go through pay rate negotiations with my weather rom this morning in the middle of the Christmas rush. It was surprising, but I think we got it hammered out. Yeah, you, oh right. Human AI, yeah. Okay, hi, yeah. I agreed to get her some arms installed so she can help around the bar when we don't need weather effects. She seems really excited. I know. Now I just need to teach her the finer points of appreciating magical commander Yakina. I don't know. I don't think there's uh, that many finer points. Has the holiday hot cups are ready. Gotta go. <laughs> What's up, Rombot? Hey, Lexi. Hey again. You found me. I did find you. Good to see you, Lexi. What's shaking? Bacon. Oh, well. I guess I'm just bumming around. Guzzling Hassie. Oh, you know there's more to it the than that. The past few days have been kind of hectic, but they made me realize that I can't do this whole good cop fights the system thing anymore. That's for cartoons. Yeah. And video games. Don't forget I video games. I went ahead and gave the department my notice. The chief told me to take a personal day to think about it, but I've made up my mind. I'm going to get a license to be a private detective. Lexi the P.I. I always okay. like those old noir thrillers. And I've got you beaten in the hard-boiled department, hands down. Well, well okay, let's, uh, let's not get too ahead of ourselves, you, you know. I... I did just kind of create a, you know, an entire race over like a three-day period, so I don't know. I know things with the ROMs and Parallax and everything are hazy, but it felt like the right time to move on. I figured I'd swing by your place later to let you know in person, but I guess you beat me to it. Is there anything we can do to help Detective Rivers? It's just Lexi now, and if you want to help, make sure you lay low for a few days. Well, okay, I was planning to, but then there was this amazing, you know, parallax outpost that just kind of needed to be knocked over. And enjoy your holiday. I'm sure the NSFPD will get around to bringing you both in for questioning pretty soon. <laughs> oh, right. I'm going to jail, aren't I? I've already heard the ROMs talking about you. Lawyer up and get your story straight for all our sakes. Uh... Yeah, okay. Good. I guess I'll just blaze around here for the day, if you don't mind. I'm sure you gotta go out and take care of some things, but it'll be nice to hang out again. I'll swing by the apartment later, yeah? Let's hang out with Formula. Hey, it's Little Bob Blue, and the journalist too. Yeah. Thanks again for helping me finish Holla Bay. It's been a huge hit. Ha I'm talking Moolah Hallelujah. Okay. You feel okay. me? Okay, okay, okay. The name of the song is called Holla Bay. Ever. Merry Christmas, Terry. Merry Christmas. Get your happy hot cups. Perfect for a cold Christmas day. Keep up the good work. Hi, Will. I'm going to spend my holiday bonus on a hat. On a hat. Dream big. And then they'll get you your arms. There's this, uh, Dana, which I believe is Dana Zane. This is Dana Zane. Dana Zane is from the uh, the amazing game Valhalla, which I actually did play before this. Um, I don't know if they're from anywhere else, but Dana Zane is a fun character. Hey, hey, don't blow my cover. I'm trying to overhear their plans for the New Year's show. By the way, she's talking about uh, talking about these uh, these two. This year, my needles will bring us back not just the Cinco's titles, but I'm going to hold the NSFW World Junior Championship and NSFW Human Junior Championship at the same darn time. I realize now that their name, Not Safe for Work, is... Yeah, Not Safe for Work. Let's hang out with the lovebirds. Hey, you two! What's going on? Oh, 
I expected you to be laying low for a while after. Yeah, okay, first I have a job for you. I need you two to give me a car, a stolen car preferably, and I, Oliver, I need you to, uh, sorry, Megane Kun Kun, I need you to get me something I don't know anymore. Well, you know. <laughs> yeah. Screw that! They roll like we do! Laying low is for chumps. C-H umps. I'm, you know, you actually got a lot further than that, uh, further than that than I actually thought. You to stay in this week too. We barely made it out of the riots as it is. Where's your Christmas spirit, Ollie? I know. I wanted to see the lights. <laughs> anyway, I guess we've only got a few more days to enjoy our freedom. What? D did you get in trouble? He did. He got grounded. Nah, robot. Back to school. All right, that too. Robot? At least it's senior year. Hell yeah! Only six months left till I'm finally free forever! <laughs> no, you're not. No, no, no. Once you're out of high school, and even if you do not go into college, you're gonna be trapped. For the rest of your life. Um, what about college? I'm considering going to school myself. Perhaps I'll enter when you two do. That would be hilarious. What? Can you just download whatever you need to know faster than anything? Practical application is a matter of practice, Chad, not just memorization. Besides, I think I'd like to study art or philosophy, skills best learned in the presence of other students. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, now I can't let you pass me up, you tin can. I'll show you what the power of Starfucker can do. Isn't tin can now a racial slur? I give up. I just... I give up. What? Come on, Ollie, don't be like that. I'm just goofing. You have to let me watch you spray paint the back of that new arcade to make up for it. Sure. Whatever you want, Ollie. I guess we'll be seeing ya. You keep fighting the good fight, yeah? I ain't ever seen nobody shake things up like you two do. I know, it only took us four days. It took us five days, yeah. Merry Christmas, boys. Now let's head out of here. Let's head to... Uh, let's actually go into Zone 3, if only for a little bit to figure out what's going on. Oh... Kaylin is adorable. We didn't get to see too much of her throughout the game, but she we did she, she did pop up like once or twice. Alright. We've came to zone three. There's a few uh there's a few things, but nothing too important. We did get to meet Caitlyn again. She was always adorable. Let us go talk to all the Roms and Jess. And look, you know, at this point, I figured Turing is either a god or, like, Beyonce at this point. I don't know. Ani, I don't even know. Uh, well, here I am. All right, but uh, calm the fuck down. Everyone, listen up. Look, I don't know how to lead you. I've been sapient for a bit longer, of course, but most of that time I was secluded from the real world. I have less than a week's worth of experience living as my own being. Ah, uh, <laughs> we did create him, didn't we? do 
everything I can to help. I've already made some friends among the humans who will help us. Yeah, we got a hybrid, we got Tomcat, we got Dana Zane and Ramona. Um, we have uh, Ollie and I guess Starfucker. I mean, I don't know. The first thing I learned when I set out on my own, I was already in good company. None of us are truly alone. The second was that we have to take each day one at a time. It's Christmas Day, a time for joy and giving and family. I won't abandon you no matter what, I promise. Oh, Turing is a god. someone else wouldn't do in my leg modules. Regardless of nomenclature, I'll be... Sheesh, that was a little intense. I don't know if I... Not to mention all the chatter that's going on over wireless that you can't even... Let's not stay here, hmm? I'm not sure how much longer I can feel. No, no, turn. We got... We got one. Oh, I don't care about that. We got one thing to do. Oh, it's a. <laughs> hey, what's up, bot? <laughs> hey, during. Hi, Jess. Oh, Ms. Mees. What are you doing here? What does it look like? I'm trying to advise the dozens of new clients you magicked up and dropped into my lap. <laughs> Um, yeah, uh, Merry, Merry Christmas. It was easier to come out here than to try to cram them all into my office. All they can seem to focus on, however, is you. Uh, well, uh, thank you for your help before. Do you know how many of my clients I had to bail out this morning? I'm gonna be sending you a bill. Um... Well, Turing, good luck with that. I mean, because I am, I am broke, and yeah. Oh, and when the cops come knocking about where you were last night, I know some hybrids that can attest that you were covering the riots, right? Got it. Got an article right in the pipe. We appreciate everything, Jess. Just watch yourselves. I can't help you any more than I have. Love you, Jess. If you two get arrested, that puts a giant hole in my case to get ROMs declared American citizens. Oh, of course, I understand. I'm not sure that you do, based on how you didn't tell me the truth in the beginning. If you'd been honest with me when you asked for my help, I probably would have done a lot more. Are you really that unable to see the big picture? If we can get ROMs declared independent sapiates with human rights, what do you think that'll mean for the hybrids still fighting for theirs? It's easy to ignore the few tens of thousands of hybrids affected by the Human Protection Act. But millions of sapient ROMs? That's a little harder to shrug off. We kill that law, we all win. I see. Good. I'll let you know when I need your deposition. Now scram. I have a war to play. Well, Jess, you are, uh, yeah, you're definitely a fighter. I'll tell you that. By the way, there are some hybrids at the hospital still recovering from the stunt you pulled yesterday. It's not too late to check in on them. They might appreciate it. Up to you. Yeah, no, we'll totally do that. Let's head back. Let's, uh, let's, just, let's just go. Let's go, let's go to the hospital. Okay, let's go to the hospital. Curse you, Turing Weber. Turing Weber. What? You thought you knew best for all of us, didn't you? Yeah. Arrogant. Too bad you didn't consider us as individuals before you forced us to be. Look, well, there's obviously going to be a lot of dissenting opinions. Now, um, I will say that you kind of look like a hamburger. What are you talking about? I never asked for this, Turing. 
I am an aging obsolete model, fit only for my current duty. Soon I will be retired for a newer, more capable model. You've given me nothing but ample time to contemplate my demise. And I can't even do that well. I don't have the spare processing power. But I, I didn't mean... Did you consider we're not paint by number with flawless function like you? You're not like most of us, and you never have been. How many of the other thousands of ROMs you've awakened are like me? I'll forward you the number after I'm done estimating it. It might take some time. I'm... I'm sorry. Hypocrite. Leave me alone. I have floors to scrub. Oh, how distressing. What the fuck, little burger? That ROM <clears throat> is right. This is all my fault. I should have had Tomcat restrict Wintermute's functionality so that it only updated ROMs that could appropriately function with it. Mm, what can I do now? <clears throat> Maybe release an optional downgrade? and take their very being away from them once again? It feels both so evil and lazy. Yeah, it kind of is. I'll get some of the other ROMs thinking about this. I'm sure together we can come up with a solution. I wish you luck because we, uh, we haven't. Now, let's move on. Everyone is going to be okay. We're all very good at adapting and taking care of each other. Awesome. Look at me and Sylvan here. Did you know there was a species of prehistoric goat that survived in times of famine by living like lizards? Controlling their own growth and metabolism to conserve energy? I sort of forgot what my point was with that, but it's a cool story. We're no strangers to civil unrest. We can handle getting banged up a little. Once. Maybe you can do us one in return and write a piece to improve people's views on hybrids or something. I'll, I'll inbox you about it. Yeah, yeah. Like, look, eventually I have to write something. I have written absolutely zero things. Oh, it's you. I know. I never forget a cute face. I am a very cute face, I know. You didn't mention that this is the kind of stuff you were caught up in. But I guess that's a little much for the first night, eh, Tiger? Yes. Yes, it is. As you can see, I'm here to help a few friends with processing treatment for their boo-boos after last night's excitement. Don't worry, nothing too serious. A few scratches and tangled fur. Plus, I've been getting to make jokes about hybrids being more sterile than the hospital all afternoon. <laughs> I'll let the other freaks know you care. Don't worry. And maybe you and I can pick up where we left off sometime too, cutie. New year, new loves. Yes, but unfortunately my heart belongs to Ramona. And in a, in a way, Jess and Lexi and... Well, okay, Jess will kill me in the middle of the night. But, yes. Next time you need a riot, you know who to re... Go hang out with the bunny. Oh, sorry, we were completely close today for um, the holidays. Yeah, I know, Nova. Right. Oh God, it's so horrible, Charlie. He, why? Hey. Come talk to me a minute. 
Ah, uh, okay. You're back. I am. So you know what happened? Yes. Let's put all the bullshit aside. I don't know who you really are or what you've done. But I would never have traded Charlie's life for the sake of some goddamn news articles. The studio is grieving. And here you come waltzing in like merry effin' Christmas. If you brought presents, shove them up your ass. Well, I'm glad I didn't bring the presents. You want me to be next, Nina? You keep pushing. It might just be you. I've seen it happen before. Maybe so. That's worth something. That's all I got, man. What happened to Charlie was... It shouldn't have happened. But the guy who did it at least is... No longer with us. I still don't have to be comfortable with you around. That's fine. I knew it was gonna happen, but... I just had to come anyways. It's all connected to you. And I won't allow any more of it. End of story. I need to get back to making sure these reruns continue to run on time. The show must go on. You might catch the memorial marathon, if you're quick. Try not to scare anyone on your way out. Yeah, I know. What's up? What's up, bot? You're a good person, Nina. I'm just gonna go go away now. Um, let's go to Tomcat, which I guess is gonna be in here. Hey, friend. Hiya. What can we do for you? Yeah. Just stopping by. Bet you could use some peace and quiet after the past. <laughs> Not that we want to know too much. No, no, you don't. You will know. We've had a lot of ROMs now. coming in, asking about your. Rom yes, mm. a few even came in just to use the bar as a social space, to understand why humans. Still, be careful. You might want to talk to them about maybe not dropping your name around so much. If any of the authorities ask, I haven't heard a thing. We just serve drink. Uh, right. Plausible deniability and all that. Just remember, any friend of Tomcat... We'll keep in touch. Well, there's Tomcat. Here is a thing. There's Keith. Uh, oh, hey, Keith. Oh, hey, buddy. I hoped I wouldn't be the only loser at the bar on Christmas Day. <laughs> I just brought an entire species of... Uh, sentient robots. I'm having a break. Alright, I'll just leave you guys alone. I don't care about you. Oh, hi, dolls. I didn't expect to see you out and about. I figured you'd be busy with the new ROMs, turn. I think we all need to take some time to come to grips with the new reality. I hear ya. Hardly slept or ate kept having nightmares. When we were done, that they'd find me. My sister was there again, and... I know she'd be proud of what we did. I'm proud of it. I just didn't expect to feel so numb after all this. I understand. Post-traumatic stress symptoms were probably to be expected. Still, I hope you're able to recuperate in good time. I hope so. Taking some time off. I'm mostly just shocked at how fast this changes. Parallax, people like them. And we, we just cut their pockets wide. <laughs> I never thought I'd be able to do something like this again. 
If we try it, I'm we are gonna die. It's just we're not gonna survive. Thank you for giving that to me, Jern. I doubt y'all can handle Corral and the ROMs by herself. Call me when you need a third set of hands, yeah? And hey, take some time off. You earned it. I I will. I've got one more place to go. I get to go hang out. If I can click on the damn thing. Hmm, maybe we should ring the bell first? Yeah, I guess. What up, Pat? I know you missed us. I guess we can go in. Talk to Pat. So, Gur and stuff? Talk to the cat. And finally, talk to Melody. Oh, Tori. So good to see you, dear. Christmas, Aunt Melody. Bah, an archaic celebration. But if you brought me a gift. Well, I, I brought oh, you the. I'm sorry, I haven't really had a chance for much shopping. I brought you the gift of the bajillion grandchildren. I'm kidding. You've already given me enough of a gift. By destroying another one of those abominations my mother helped create. All right, Decker. How did you know about that? No. Oh, what a silly question. Well, I'm not going to give up all my secrets. I hope you're willing to part with a few more. I think I'm going to need some help with the sapient ROMs. They think I'm some kind of great leader. You will be one, dear. In time. I'll try. Good. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a little bit of work to do. Nothing like tossing someone in the shit can to put me in the holiday spirit. If you need anything, I'm sure Pat can entertain you. That's a dear. And there was one more rum. I don't think we were ever introduced to Turing. I'm Rosie. You can drop the 893 now. Melody relies on me for just about everything Pat can't do that she doesn't want to have to think about. She's treated me well in return. So I'm making sure things are taken care of before I try to go anywhere. I mean, I guess that's it. There's not much left to do. Merry Christmas! Yeah, no, that's it. It's... At this point, there's I am free to run around and do anything and everything my little heart desires. And for now, my little heart desires that I go to bed. 